How's it going, guys? My name is Nick Plessis. And I'm Matt Buholtz. And we are here talking about a Battleborn demo that I recently returned from. Uh, the reason we're not posting this, like some of our other previews, is that the recording that took place at the event came away with no, no audio. Uh, no audio at all over the game footage. So you guys won't get to uh, know what this sounds like. Uh, here we go. I'm playing a new character that has that was just recently announced, uh, Whiskey Foxtrot. Very similar to Oscar Mike. Um, did you use Oscar Mike? I used Oscar Mike in the beta, yeah. I played the closed beta a little bit. Uh, yeah, he's kind of an off-kilt soldier. Yeah, yeah, kind of the, the most contemporary shooter sort of archetype that you can get is these two characters. And one thing I noticed, using him and his sim similarities to Oscar Mike... It seems like, you know, they, they kind of, they seem to kind of run in a pair. Like him, even their if you look, their helmet is almost identical except for mm -hmm. a crack. So it seems like they're kind of a pair. And then I noticed two other characters um, looked almost like siblings. Um, and so I'm wondering if like, if it's kind of built that way or if that's maybe just like a creative coincidence, you know? No, I'm sure their... that's a design thing because Gearbox has always been great at building the universe in which the game takes place in. Yeah. And Battleborn does have that whole campaign mode as well, so I wouldn't be surprised to see these characters have overlaps in their backstories. Yeah. What mode are you playing right now? Okay, so this is a newly announced mode, brand new. It's called Incursion, and it's possibly the most MOBA-ish mode out of the three. Now, if and I'm, I am drawing a blank on the other two, I believe one's called Mayhem, and I think one's called Control. Do you have any... Verification. I, I, I remember for sure Mayhem. Right. I believe that's the one that was in the beta. Right. So I'm pretty sure Control is the um, is just a very contemporary kind of domination capture his own type mode. Mayhem is the uh, is the more MOBA ish type mode where you uh, just basically follow a track of minions to their objective. Yeah. You push your creep yeah, waves. Exactly. The the Matt is the, <laughs> Matt's the MOBA guy. I am not. I'm the shooter guy. We got the MOBA guy. Um, and now this one. The, what, what sets this one apart is there's two, and now you're going to help have to help me with all this yeah. MOBA terminology. Yeah. Um, you have two kind of nodes that you have to, you know, what are, what are those big objectives you have to kill the in The bases, MOBA? usually. The bases, yeah. okay. So in this, in this case, uh, the bases take on the role of these two giant robot spiders. Mm -hmm. One is built very assault. It has a lot of, lot of cannons, cannons, does a lot of damage, and one's built kind of more defense. And they're, on the map, they're kind of in, in a linear structure. So it's like you get to the closest enemy's spider is going to be always the attacking one, and then the defending is going to be their last line of defense, the last one. And if you kill both enemy spiders, that team wins. And it's like if you get one and the other team gets none, Obviously, you win, and then if, depending on whose health is sort of the uh, identifier for who, you know, if it's a closer game, for who wins. Hmm. Um, any uh, any questions on that? No, I mean, that sounds really interesting. It's pretty straightforward. I like that there are, like, two objectives to it. It's not yeah. just, like, destroying a core. Right, 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 yeah. Which is what uh, Mayhem was mostly like. Yeah, and they, uh, you know, that, that attacking, the attack and defense role of them plays a huge difference, because the attacking one is the one that's a lot harder to get past. You know, because if you poke your head out, that thing is drilling into you. And then once you get that, then the enemy team, it's more of the enemy team's responsibility to defend their defending spider. So real quick, what's going on here is that there's, now again, now you call them super minions, I guess? Well, in MOBAs, in, as a MOBA uh, term, usually there will be inhibitors that you have to destroy, which are near the core. And once okay. you destroy those, more powerful waves will start pushing. Okay. So like your average... Uh, minion that you see there is normally called like a creep. Okay. And so you get your creep waves. But once you destroy the inhibitor, then more powerful ones tend to go. Okay. And so those would be your super minions. Okay. So yeah, I mean, in that sense, we have we have kind of the the creep wave creep waves as we call them coming down the middle, just different levels of uh, of minions, you know, different powers. But then on on one's kind of side of the map, there's three different um, pads and three different areas defended by what the game calls thralls. Now these are huge, really beefy minions, and if you kill the thrall in that zone, you stand on the pad, and then it spawns a new one, which works for you. Each side has one pad defended by one thrall, and then there was a pad kind of near the center, which was defended by two thralls, and that made a huge difference, because they didn't, they didn't deal a ton of damage, but they were really beefy, and they were more of a, and as the developers were talking about, they're more of a distraction, you know, they keep your attention while you should be focusing on other things. 
So the uh, the video's moving right along here. We have this new character. Um, Shannon Oryx. Shannon, yes. She's like this teenager encompassed in a demon. Very heavy uh, melee character. She has very little range at all. And I don't know how much uh, footage we'll see of her compared to the last character, but I do not do well with her at all. I just don't get it. Um, <laughs> it uh, so I don't they, do well at all with this character, yeah. Nick says as he goes on well, a okay. great kill spree. Spencer, our, our, our lovely Spencer who edited this, you know, he tried to make me look good. Trust me, it goes bad for some of the parts you don't see. So every character has a uh, primary attack, alternate attack, two different abilities, and then like an alternate ability, and then a passive ability. Hers are um, just kind of basic swipes and a, and a boomerang that does a little damage for her uh, basic attacks. And then her abilities are a grab, which she sends out the demon to grab onto someone, and it holds them, but you have to go to them to do any damage. So it just holds onto them for a little while in that spot that it grabs them. And then her other is a stealth, something that makes you go invisible. But to the extent that I could figure out, you don't get to decide when you become visible. You have to be over a person with a target at the moment your timer runs out, and that does damage to them. Kind of situational, hard to figure out. And then her ultimate is like an artillery strike. I barely figured that out. But um, it was it was kind of it was kind of a rough it was kind of a rough experience with her. Nick's still not talking about it. This is the first he's brought it up to me. He came back two days ago. Yes, yeah. No, I mean, it was, it was, it, overall, and I guess we'll kind of close out with this, I have fun with it. My biggest problem is balancing. Um, and I know that's kind of cliche, but it's, I don't know, did you, did you experience any concerns with, the, with character balancing? It's always hard yeah, in these kind I of mean, shooters. But. We're, we're still in the beta. I mean, we have, the game's coming out in a couple months now. And, I mean, you're going to find these balancing issues throughout no matter what you play. I mean, I definitely encountered it during the closed beta with a couple of the different characters, just like rolling face. Yeah. And I'd like to say it was because of balance and not because of my ability. <laughs> I, th I, will, I will say that for you too, Matt. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, that's, um, that's our uh, Battleborn preview. Um, we'll probably have more. The open, we have open beta coming up soon. Yeah. Do we not? Yeah. Um, I, if I'm not mistaken. So we'll probably have uh, more footage on that. And thanks for listening, guys. I'm Nick. And I'm Matt. And we'll see you later. Thank you. For egmnow.com.